<laughs> I don't know if the umbrella scene is gonna work and do the trick. Hey guys, Mark Magstead, local real estate expert here in San Diego. And man, you've been asking, and I'm here to deliver today. It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia React video. Always Sunny is about the gang, a group of misfits who loves nothing more than to scheme, conspire, and revel in each other's misery. Before I get started, I want you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Let's go. Hey, get the hell out of our house! Jesus, there's people here! Squatters! We're not squatters, this is our house! What do you mean your house? I bought this house. Yeah, yeah, you got proof? Proof? What are you talking about, proof? A deed, paperwork, yeah. go get your proof. proof. Bring it back here, we'll look at the yeah. paperwork. Is that what you want? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah. Now proof. give me a proof. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> all right, so squatters, we've all dealt with them. And, and it, it's funny nowadays because they have a system called cash for keys. So if you are buying a house, regardless if it's a foreclosure or not, and there are tenants or people that are occupying the home, you're gonna know before close of escrow if they are gonna move out or if they're gonna stay. So I don't know if the umbrella scene is gonna work and do the trick, but cash for keys or something, you know, Realistically, knowing that they're gone before you actually come to the home is obviously a great idea. My door! My door! All right, so realistically, I, I don't foresee this ever happening. I'm gonna tell you this has never happened to me, luckily. There are times when it does get definitely a lot of tension, especially with foreclosures, because that means that the people can no longer afford their home. Some people foreclose and they're like, okay, done, let's just move on. But then others are extremely attached to the property. So realistically, this is a circumstance that you want to just be cool, be calm, maybe knock, use the doorbell versus the, uh, the door basher. <laughs> the real estate business is something that takes a lot of style and a lot of finesse. And that's something that the two of us both have in space. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm thinking we do like a classic good realtor, bad realtor dynamic. Good realtor, bad realtor. I, I like to think that all of us are good realtors. Um, you know, there's always gonna be some bad sprinkled in here and there, but realistically, the main reason that you hire us is that we have trust, confidentiality, and we have a fiduciary duty to you as you being our client. So realistically, I don't know about this good realtor, bad realtor, but let's see how it plays out. Vic, you got that other snack tray? I certainly do, Hugh, okay, certainly great. do. People are gonna be here any second. I yeah. want them to be well fed. The house looks nice. <laughs> this takes me back. Those are the old Century 21 gold jackets, which they used to wear. Um, I've heard of doing open houses and having like fresh baked cookies and whatnot, but I've never seen the uh, spray cheese and crackers. I, I may have to give that a shot. Hi, hey, how are you doing? We're uh, here to look at the house. Of course. <laughs> I just had to pause it at the very beginning based on the duct tape. You know, they can't duck it. Heck with it. Um, I probably would have replaced that front door if I'm going to try to sell this thing. Otherwise, you're going to be doing some definite explaining of what's going on there. Want any are trouble, you sir? No, Please. Are you going to find this house? Are you going to find this house? Yes! 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 Okay, so that reminds me of, you can't handle the truth. Realistically, you cannot force anyone into buying a home. So that, what we just saw, that's not gonna cut it. <laughs> that was amazing, bro. You think that's gonna work? Bro, it already did work. You heard the skirt. She said, yes, I will buy this house. That is a binding verbal contract. <laughs> a binding verbal contract. There's no such thing as a binding verbal contract. There is such a thing as a binding signed residential purchase agreement, but realistically, this isn't gonna do it. Man, what a crazy show. You know, I don't know if Mac and Dennis are really cut out to be real estate agents, but you know what? You never know. I don't think any of the stuff that I saw today is realistic in the real estate world, but great funny show. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.